Last push here on Football Friday. We'll hit up a triple-A matchup from Raleigh County. First game on the new carpet for the Flying Eagles. And uh, they were hosting Parkersburg South this evening. Another nice night out in Beckley. <laughs> the Flying Eagles getting themselves all kinds of excited. First quarter, 4.09 left. Sam Schuler is going to toss this one for the visitors right in the breadbasket to Levi Rice. It is seven to nothing quickly in favor of the Patriots. Then a couple minutes later, still in that first quarter, Maddox McMillan dropping back, picking it off though. Dink, dank, and dunk for Levi Rice again, this time on the defensive end. Taking over just about a minute later, it's Schuler again to Gage Wright. Gage Wright scooting on in there for the touchdown. Now we head over to the second quarter, and it's going to be Beckley ball again. Good look up the middle, but it's going to be fumbled. Balls on the ground, picked up by Cyrus Trow, and then still in that second quarter, just about four minutes left. Beckley's going to get some positive results here right on the goal line. Keenan Cook comes up with a pick and a nice run back here for the Eagles, but at just 44 total yards in that first half. As you can see, one last touchdown here before the half for the Patriots as Landon Francisco falling right under this one, 42 to six. Parkersburg South goes on to get that victory. A couple more scores from around the area for you. Pocahontas County, they go on and go to, on the road, I should say, to Tucker County, they get that 36 to 6 victory over the Mountain Lions and another score from up in the Eastern Panhandle Greenbrier East started out strong against the Jefferson Cougars but Jefferson just too much in the end there 42 23 is your final 